second performance. Well, what he wanted was always to play for the Yankees. He signed with them to win not just one, but multiple world championships. That obviously won't happen this year. So a disappointment for him and the Yankees. Let's hear from Cole post game. Garrett, can you just describe your disappointment knowing that the season has ended for you guys tonight? Um, yeah, it's a big disappointment. Um, not, uh, not the way we drew it up. Um, really hard fought series, um, you know, that, that sometimes can make it tougher to swallow too, so. Pitching for the first time on short rest looked like it took you a little while to get in a groove and then it seemed like you really found your way. What adjustments did you make from the first inning to, to the second inning? Yeah, I mean, Meadows came out super aggressive, right? Swinging at uh, first three pitches, I thought. So, um, you know, we went after Lau, I think, with the same intent. Uh, laid off some good pitches at the top of the zone. Um, you know, first fastball inside to a right-hander, Rosa Reina, you know, obviously hits him. So we got a bit of traffic there. Do a good job with Choi. Um, and then, you know, try to, you know, I executed some good pitches to Diaz. Obviously didn't want to lose leverage there. Uh, and then made some big pitches to Wendell. You know, I think that was, I think those those first three sprays were, were, were some of the pitches that, um, you know, maybe, maybe I should have backed off the throttle a little bit. But hey, you know, we came back through the count and, um, you know, made some good pitches. So, um, I thought that the approach, I, I, you know, I just thought Lau put together a good at bat. I mean, you know, uh, just based on what I had seen, uh, we were anticipating maybe a little more expansion at the top of the zone, so. That home run in the fifth, did you think that Judge, prior to hitting the wall, had a shot at that ball? Yeah, I did. I mean, you know, I didn't think Meadows was sure he got it. Um, you know, I'll, I guess, I guess uh, you know, that ball and the, the to the left, uh, you know, Barely got out, so you know, good, you know, good swing, um, good swing, decent pitch. Probably should have been, could have been a better pitch. So, Ron Blum, you have the next question. As you look back at the whole first season for you in New York. What do you remember most? What do you think you did well? And what areas do you expect more of yourself from looking ahead to next year? Yeah, I mean, I think the first first season, is, you know, everybody's going to think about is coronavirus, right? Like, it's just on the forefront of all our minds in terms of our performance. Um, you know, we continue to get better throughout the year. I think there's room for improvement. Um, you know, we're always trying to evaluate, always trying to get better. Um, you know, but I, I mean, I, it would be hard for me to say that I'm not pleased with, you know, with how he we went about it. There were a lot of challenges, you know, dealing with a newborn, being across the country, you know, I haven't seen my family, um, you know, and I, I thought, you know, I mean, it was really hard. Um, it was really hard at times. And so, um, you know, I, I just did the best I could. And um, so, you know, I, I, I will try to get better, um, but, you know, it, it's all out there. I didn't, you know, I, I probably wanted to face, you know, I wanted to face Choi. I wanted to get through the rest of the inning, but, you know, you know, it, you know it's probably out of bullets. So, you know, anytime I can walk away from it, you know, not, you know, not having anything left in the tank, you know, I mean, you know, at least that feels good. Thank you. Andy Martino, you have the next question. I don't have a question, Mike. Sorry, that was nice. James Wagner, you have the next question. It's the same thing, I think, from the previous one. Sorry, but uh, Garrett, I mean, um, um, just looking back at this season and this team, and obviously, I know it's your first first year with them, but what do you, what do you think would help you uh, this, the Yankees get over the hump? As you know, they haven't been to the World Series in a while. Uh, just what do you think stood out to you about strengths of this team and what I guess could be improved to, to, to get to the next step? Um, yeah, I mean, that's, you know, that's probably more of a, probably more of a question for cash. Um, you know, um, so I'll probably give you, I'll probably, I mean, I'll probably just give you some vanilla here. I mean, I, I think we need to get better across the board, right? I mean, 
you know, there are times where we pitch really well. There are times where we pitch poorly. Um, you know, so uh, we'll, we'll, we'll need to make, you know, we'll need to get better there. Um, you know, you know, every, every player is probably going to look themselves in the mirror and, 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 and evaluate themselves and, 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 you know, try to find something to work on and, and get better for next season. So, I mean, you know, we didn't reach the goal, right? So across the board, we need to improve. Next one to Marley Rivera. Jared, you um, last year obviously saw a very different result with Earl this Chapman on the mound. But, uh, just to see it from the other side and what Chapman has done for you guys and to see him go down that way, what was that like? Yeah, I mean, that's, that's tough. <laughs> I can see it in his face, you know, when I look into his eyes. So, um, you know, he was able to bounce back from last year. He'll bounce back from this year. He's a special player. Um, you know, he's committed to the team. He's committed to getting better. Um, you know, but having being on the team that delivered the punch last year um, and then, you know, being on the team that takes it this year, um, you know, I can, I can see where is it. So, I mean, he's human just like all of us. It's a, it's a tough spot. Brendan Cuddy, you have the next question. Here, right now, the Rays are playing New York, New York while they're celebrating on the field. What do you think about that? I mean, it's their celebration, so. I understand. And did, can I just ask you what the, what the clubhouse was like uh, after the loss? That had to have been one of the tougher experiences you've had. Yeah, I mean, came six outs away from the ring last year, so. They're all tough, man. It was quiet. Thank you. Dave Lennon, you have the next question. Yeah, d despite the long first inning, it seemed like you had this mapped out pretty good. I mean, the, the next couple of innings, the pitch count was down, and you had to be feeling pretty good about your chances to get fairly deep in the game. The, the fourth, obviously, you ran into you know, the error and then the 10 pitch at bat. but. When you caught your stride there, did you think you had a real shot to, to go pretty deep, deep in this one? Yeah, I, some things would have. I mean, you, you, I mean, you know, you, you try. You're just fighting hard not to get the mark in the first inning, right? You know, you want to keep the game tied, so you know you're going to pick around the zone a little bit to a certain extent. Try to find your outs. Try to find times to be aggressive in the zone. Try to find times not to mess around in the zone. Um, so not as efficient as we wanted to be in the first. And then, you know, some guys put together some good at-bats, man. And and, um, and uh, so, you know, we got to the sixth. Uh, of course, of course, we want to get deeper. Um, you know, but, you know, leaving, leaving with the game tied doesn't feel as good as leaving with the lead. Um, obviously, the mistake pitch there was unfortunate. Um, you know, but I, I felt good about, you know, I felt good about holding them down. I mean, gosh, how many times did I pitch against these guys this year? Like six or seven. It's just like, it's just like on a tape recorder with these guys. It's tough. It's just tough. Um, you know, they put together, you know, I mean, it's a good fight. It's a good fight. It sucks losing.